Hey YouTube, Carl here. Welcome to the vlog. Today, I'm bringing you guys along with me to the Sony event that I'm actually attending here in Marina Bay Sands in Singapore. So I'll just tag you guys along because I have no idea what's going to happen. So this will most likely be a very raw vlog. Speakers of the day, not that. We're actually going to go with the Converse Off-Whites OG with our Stan Street Fighter socks. Boom! Hey guys, we're here at the Vlog with Sony event here in Marina Bay Sand. This is like their art and science we see you. And it's just really nice to see that I have my picture on the wall, which is kind of crazy because you don't get to see that every day. And what's even crazier is out of all the pictures that they could have used for my picture for today, check out what they used. This is like corporate Carlo. <laughs> All the other YouTubers and vloggers and content creators from Philippines and Southeast Asia are here. So yeah, it looks like they're going to launch a new camera. I think it's their new action camera. And apart from that, they're really making a hard push towards getting more content creators, YouTubers, and vloggers to use Sony cameras. I think most of you already know that other brands are usually the number one like cameras that people pick when it comes to vlogging. So it's nice to see that Sony is really upping up their game when it comes to content creation tools and making products really meant for vloggers and content creators. Let's go. Thank you all for coming down today with Sony just finished their event and they actually launched a new action portable vlogging camera which is called the RX0 Mark II. So I actually have it here in my hand. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to be in this area but I'm the only guy here with the unit so here we have it. This is the camera itself. It's actually that small square that you guys see mounted on the grip stand. So this is the grip stand that you can use to control like uh, either you know going wide or zooming in and at the same time you can use it to take photos or to take like videos to press the record button so this grip stand is actually very very useful it can actually function as well as a tripod now talking about the camera the camera has like an amazing one inch sensor that allows for you to take really great video really great photos with it it's also super portable as you guys can see very small very easy to use at the same time it's also waterproof shock proof and it's even like crush proof according to them and lastly, it does come with a lot of vlogging accessories that will allow you to use it as your main recording camera. So it has like a microphone, it has like a stand and a bunch of other stuff that you can use with this particular camera. So I'm not sure if it's going to come out anytime soon in the Philippines, but yeah, very good. Looking forward to actually using this, looking forward to using it as a vlogging camera. So watch out for that when I get my hands on it so I can actually do a full review. By the way, one thing I find really interesting is that it has like a flip screen. So you don't see that usually with like action cameras like this one. So that's definitely a nice addition to it. So if you want to use it as a vlogging camera, you can actually get to see yourself as you take your videos while you are either walking around or while you are even diving underwater. So that's a nice addition. Makes you think that they really thought about how it can work best for vloggers and content creators who don't have a dedicated cameraman. What's up everyone? My name is Dwayne Wooly, isa kong Australiano na nagtatagalog din. So wag kayong mag-alala, walang magna-nosebleed dito. <laughs> so they can find you on... Yes, find me on YouTube. Search mo lang Dwayne Wooly. I'll put the link down below. Check Ayan. it out guys. Salamat. Boom. 
guys are here at the gadget floor of the Sony event. So they're showcasing us the different technologies that Sony has. So right now this demo is showing how crazy the tracking is of the lens of built in, of course, with like artificial intelligence and stuff of the camera itself. So you guys can see there, there's a dancer, there's the camera, the tracking never loses focus. I'm back in the hotel. I am tired, so I wanted to take a few minutes to rest. But I wanted to answer the question out of all the cameras that Sony has, which should be the best? And I think the answer to that is pretty obvious. There is no one camera. It really depends on how you will use it. Because for example, if you want like a lot of action shots, then obviously the, the RX0 Mark II action camera will work for you. If you want something that's more cinematic and professional, then obviously you'd want to use the Alpha series. They're the pro grade expensive models. If you have a cameraman with you going around, like following you around, then obviously the Handicam model would be the best option for you. And if you want something just portable, easy to use, then of course you can go for the Mark RX series. You can go for like the point and shoots that Sony has uh, in their collection. So I guess ultimately the great thing about the current situation is that they have a lot of options and it boils down to us, the consumers, to pick which one is the camera that we prefer to use. Now, personally, I'm leaning towards obviously the Alpha series mainly because of the content that I create on this site. But for those situations wherein I just want to bring out a small camera that will not take like a lot, take up a lot of space and I can shoot a little bit more like discreet, especially when I'm, you know, in stores doing like my, my, my sneaker shopping videos, I would love, absolutely love to have the RX a Zero Mark II action camera. That one is a gem. That one I will definitely add to my collection uh, in my vlogging and blogging or whatever content creation arsenal. And before we end this vlog, I just want to give you guys a quick review of the Converse off-white OG sneaker from the 10. This one looks amazing. This one got me a ton of compliments. I think around like four or five people said that I had a nice shoe. Uh, especially if you're, you know, you can even like style it up a bit by playing around with the socks that you have. Uh, I actually use my Stan Street Fighter socks so that there's a pop of blue, orange, and pink and different kinds of colors coming out of the translucent sides of the shoe. So style-wise, amazing. Two thumbs up, off-white Converse, you knocked it out of the ballpark. The bad part, this is one uncomfortable, mm. <laughs> I mean, OFG. That's the reason why I actually went up to the, to the hotel room because it is such an uncomfortable sneaker. I think I, I'll probably end up selling it again. Hopefully I can still get back the money of how much I paid for it. I bought it for resale, uh, dead stock, brand new. So yeah, that was one uncomfortable shoe. But man, if you, if you want like just to look really nice, you want to look really dope, really fly, and, and, and you want to you know, play with your sock game a bit, that shoe, guys, definitely the one that you might want to consider trying out. It's unique, it's different, and it is popping loud, especially if you put on the right up, the right socks. And that actually wraps up my vlog for vlog, hashtag vlog with Sony, where this is the reason why they actually invited me out to Singapore. I've been shooting most of this footage, of course, with the Handycam that I got from them. So if you guys want the full review of this Handycam, please do let me know. I would love to do like another tech video for you guys. Uh, it's been a while, so it's, it's actually fun to do tech every now and then to take a break from the sneakers. Uh, but anyway, thank you Sony Philippines for having me out here. I appreciate it. Maraming maraming. Salamat po. Lastly, guys, to end the vlog, I just want to cut to a few clips of YouTuber Sam Chewy. He's a really famous international YouTuber who does a lot of music and songs, that has his own songs. And they actually, Sony actually invited him to go to Singapore to sing a few songs for us, uh, the audience, during the event. So I just want to cut to a few clips of him singing to be able to wrap up and end this vlog. That's it for now. Peace. God bless. Oh, don't forget. My entire Singapore series will be in a Singapore sneaker shopping play playlist. Link to that playlist will be found, found below. If you guys haven't watched any of the previous videos yet, please do check it out. Binge watch everything. Show some support. Show some love for your boy. That's it for now. Peace. God bless. What's up? Boom. When I see you shine, shine love, light me up. Feels like a sun. Tell me to be next to love. With one spark, one open heart, you start a chain of light and I wanna have mine when I see you shine. 
It's another little thing Cause you said my world in motion One word starts echoing Ripple like waves in the ocean 